na tukisalia huko pwani ni kwamba wakazi wa mji wa kale kisiwani Mombasa wanalamikia uhaba wa maji wanaodai umekithiri kwa muda wa miezi sita sasa hali hiyo wanasema imewalazimu kununua maji wanayosema ni hali mno kampuni ya kusambaza maji ya Mombasa imekiri kuwepo kwa uhaba wa bidhaa hiyo muhimu wanaodai umechangia na kiangazi kinachoshuhudiwa huko nchini mwanahabari wetu Francis Mtalake na taarifa zaidi kutoka huko Mombasa ni baadhi ya wakazi na wazee wa mji wa kale ambao ujio wao katika afisi za shirika la usambazaji maji kaunti ya Mombasa ni kuwasilisha kilio cha kukosa kukatakiu kwa zaidi ya miezi sita sasa. Tulikuwa tukichezewa mchezo wa paka na panya. Kesho unaambiwa hakuna moto sijui baricho hivi ma... lakini mitaa mingine yote Mombasa inapata maji. Lengo letu tunataka ile siku ambazo sisi tuwapata maji especially kwa sasa inakuja Thursday, Wednesday na Thursday maji lazima yaweko whether watu wengine wamepata zote siku zote ni siku zote ni ziregeshi. Ushaona hiyo ndio aim yetu ya kuja hapa kulingana nao Maafisa wa kusambaza maji kaunti ya Mombasa wamekuwa kitelekeza baadhi ya sehemu licha ya kuwa na taratibu ya kupata maji. Old Town Ward ndio ward ya kwanza kihistoria. Huku ndiyo serikali ya Kenya ilikoanza lakini ni masikitiko makubwa hakuna maji. Tunalipa bills kila siku tunaletewa mabili tunalipa maji lakini kumbe tunalipia bili za upepo. Tumefanya surveys siku ya maji tunaona mitaa yote kitu kama nyali siku wajua tuna siku zetu za maji ni sunday monday wednesday na thursday siku hizo sisi tukienda tukiangalia mitaa mingine ambao si siku zao za maji tutakuta wanapata maji na sisi kwetu tumefungiwa maji tumefungiwa maji the sources are not under our control and we also understand that those sources are supplying other water companies which also are not meeting their demand Whatever basically we do is whatever quantity we get we try as much as possible to equitably distribute to all the people Sasa wanamtaka gavana wa kaunti ya Mombasa Abdul Samad Sharif Nasir kuingilia kati na kutatua uhaba wa maji ambao wanasema si maeneo ya Old Town pekee yanayokosa maji Mombasa water imeshindwa ku deliver imeshindwa Kiswahili wazi imeshindwa ku deliver na ujumbe huu mfikie governor manake governor mwenyewe is hata ana habari na sisi old town especially what you kombali na old town he doesn't care what's going mtu ambaye ni maskini analipa elfu moja kwa siku mkokoteni kuletwa maji what is this how can we have a government that cannot deliver clean water to our people kwa hivyo tumekuja tumelazimika si kupenda kwetu tumelazimika tumeshindwa kustahimili pesa hatuna tena za kutoa za kulipa maji tumepoteza pesa yetu eh hii ni service tunastahili kupata. Ni huduma tunatakana tupatiwe. Eh? We are paying for this service. Sio bure. Ila maafisa katika shirika hili la kusambaza maji wanadai kuwepo kwa kiangazi nchini kumechangia kwa uhaba wa maji unaoshuhudiwa. Nobody is getting is no is getting enough but the moment we get lower supply and you get lower than what you are getting you start assuming that maybe you are being denied water. So basically what we try to do is whatever supply we get we try as much to equitably make sure that at least every person get even if it's not adequate. Maji ya visima ndio na mkokoteni mmoja ni 500. Yeah imagine kila nyumba mtu anataka at least mikokoteni miwili. Hiyo ni kwa siku au siku mbili na hii ni Ramadhani. Hii ni haki. Hebu naulize nyinyi hii ni haki. Lakini other areas kama Nyali yanapata maji bila wasiwasi. Sasa sijui kwa sababu ni huu kuna umaskini mwingi ama ni kuna udhaifu wengi ama tumepiga kura kwa watu wengine ambao sasa sisi we are paying the price. Baadhi ya maeneo pia ambayo yamesemekana kukosa maji ni Bamburi, Vescon na pia mji wa Kale. Francis Mtulaki, Runinga Citizen, Mombasa. Tukiachana na taarifa hiyo kutoka Mombasa ni